Another key trend, diagnosis diseases faster and better. How do we help medicines, doctors with intelligent autom automation? This program helps just by using the brief to analyze and identify more than 17 diseases. So can you imagine we can identify early more than 17 diseases without even taking a shot or even, even doing anything, just exhaling our breath. That's a very, uh, an amazing one by MIT. Um, it can identify cancers, skin cancers in just a few seconds like this, just from a, a picture taken from a, um, a smartphone, okay? With nine, more than 90% accuracy. So when we look at our IT strategy and we look at our finance goals for the any respective year in relation to automation or hyper automation, we ensure that we are following the pillars set forth by IT and that strategy. So one is around accelerating our digitization and um, through that citizen developer rollout and, um, and adoption, you can then see how the business begins to evolve their uh, thinking to an automation first mindset, right? And that's really where you want your business to get to the art of the possible, um, no longer reimagining it uh, by the way that humans do it, but by the way the automation needs to be best built. I believe the core theme here is, is collaboration yeah. and, and transparency, and, and I think that's absolutely essential. That, that's part of the partnership of having IT involved. Um, collectively, if you add up all the talent in any one particular war room, regardless of what division of the business they come from, there is a collateral benefit of experience once it's been shared. In addition to that, while I have never brought chocolate or flowers or anything like that, I, I can absolutely say that it's, it's humbling to be in the room full of like-minded professionals who can share, but when you're collaborating on a strategy and you're both aligned to the same business objective, you tend to get a lot more done and both parties have a shared ownership in that cause, you're not knocking on someone's door trying to sell them automation. Instead, you're saying, I have a tool that is going to drive these enablements across the organization. And collectively as an organization, we're all facing the same crisis and let's figure out how we can solution this together. After a lot of uh, discussion with our IT, uh, with our security team, with our trusted partners, with the help of UiPath, uh, we came up with, uh, with an approach which was very suitable for us, uh, which is in fact uh, a two-stage or two-phased approach in this case. Uh, the first approach, uh, uh, the first step in this is to let's migrate the or orchestrator infrastructure to automation cloud. Uh, once that is done, then let's migrate uh, the robot farms infrastructure which we have onto the cloud as well. And I'm going to touch that in, in more detail because that is the place where we being VMware, we are actually using a VMware on VMware approach on that as well.